Hi, I'm T. Cooper. I'm a New York City makeup artist, hairstylist, and co-founder of beauty and grooming business, Metro Look. Today, I'm gonna show you how to sew two hair wefts together. A weft is like the top part of a track. The hair is sewn onto a weft. So the weft just refers to this part right at the top where all the sewing is going on. These are clip-in extensions, but I can still show you how to sew the two wefts together. So I have two clip-in extensions and I'm gonna put them together and I'm gonna sew them like so from the top. So to do that, you're gonna need a needle, a thread, and a pair of scissors. So I've got my curved needle right here. It's best that you use a curved needle even though you're not sewing it directly into your hair because it just helps you maneuver in and out of the wefts a little better. So I'm just gonna roll off some thread. Gonna cut it. and thread my needle. So you put the thread right into the eye as you would with a regular sewing kit. It's no difference, pretty much the same concept. And you go to the end and you knot it, of course, because if you don't knot it, you never know. The, the thread might just go right through, slide right through the track and nothing will stick. So the knot makes it nice and secure. So when you go through it, it stops and you can just keep looping around. So you put the two tracks together, like so, and then you go from one side of the weft. Sometimes it might be a little hard. It's a little bit tight, but that's good. The weft should be sewn tight because that means that this hair won't slide off, but you're just gonna have to maneuver it. That's why I say the skinnier the needle that you can find, the better. This isn't the kind that you get in a beauty supply store. Those are a little bit thicker. I actually got this in a craft store. This was part of a quilting kit and they're sharper also. But if you use a regular weaving thread, it'll do the job. It's just that it's a little bit of a thicker needle and you'll need to put a little bit more elbow grease in it. And you just repeat this process, going all the way down the weft. And I'm just gonna go through one more time. And then once you get to the end of it, you want to knot it. That way all the sewing that you did doesn't come out. So you go through as you would if you were sewing, but instead of stopping, what you do is when this is, you get a little loop right here, put the needle through the loop, and then you knot it. And I like to do that twice just to secure it, to make sure that it won't get loose because that's the last thing you want is your weave falling apart. After you do that, take your scissors and you cut. And there you have two wefts sewn together and becoming one. This is a great thing to do if you have tracks and you wanna make them a little bit thicker or if you just want a more voluminous look in your hair. I'm T. Cooper, thank you for watching.